The Supreme Court has stayed offline plus one exams and the Pay Commission has recommended raising the retirement age. Hello, this is Mahimana Jacob with the New Indian Express news updates from Kerala. The Supreme Court today stayed the conduct of offline exams for plus one students in Kerala. The exams were scheduled to start on September 6th. The court said the COVID situation in Kerala is alarming and children of tender age can't be exposed to the risk. The Kerala Pay Revision Commission has recommended raising the retirement age of government employees by one year to 57 years. The commission also proposed introduction of five-day week and extension of working hours by one hour. It proposed to restrict the number of annual holidays to 12 days and reduce the number of earned leaves to 30 days. Former KPCC Secretary P.S. Prashant, who was expelled from the Congress last week, has joined the CPM. The Kerala High Court has observed that the police should be polite while interacting with the public. Considering a case of police excess, the court directed the DGP to issue a circular to this effect. The court also sought a report from the state police chief on the steps taken to implement the ban on Nokukuli, the organised extortion by Labour Union. Karnataka has stopped stamping home quarantine mark on the hands of Kerlites with indelible ink following protests. The Kerlites who cultivate ginger in Karnataka had complained that the authorities at Bavali check post were stamping home quarantine seal on their hands. Kerala reported 29,322 fresh cases of COVID-19 today and the test positivity rate declined to 17.91%. There's a district wise breakup of fresh cases. Thrissur 3530, Ernakulam 3435, Korikot 3344, Kollam 2957, Malapuram 2736, Palakkad 2545, Alapura 2086, Trivantapuram 1878, Kotem 1805, Kannur 1490, Patram Tita 1078, Vayana 1003. Idiki 961 and Kasargod 474. That's all for now. For more updates, please follow our social media handles. Thank you and stay safe.